I just want to share with you all the books that are inside the Use Born Business Kits. Now, I got the $75 um, dollar one, and I want to share with you the books that are coming in. I know sometimes we're so curious, oh, what's in the box? So, I'm here to show you the books. So, I'm going to start with Life Size. So this book is life size and inside it kind of gives you some ideas for kids of how some things are life size. For instance, this. They show you this is as big the life size of an elephant's toenail. <laughs> it's really cute. Tells you just the life size of, of just many things. So the two cans be and it's just really cute. So you're gonna get the book Life Size. Another book that you will be receiving in your kit is I Love You Animally. This is actually a really cute book. It does. I love you hugely like a whale. I love you shyly like a quail. I love you cleverly like a fox. And then the next one. I love this one. I love you powerful, powerfully like an ox. So cute. So you will get I love you animally. Another one. Giraffe in the bath. So you're going to get Giraffe in the Bath. It's really, it's like a rhyming book. It's really cute. Um, of course, you could tell that it's going to be about a giraffe. She's out and she gets dirty and she's tired and she wants to take a bath. And every time she tries to take a bath, something happens. Someone knocks on the door. She ends up sliding out. It's a really cute book. So you're going to get Giraffe in the Bath. These are one of my favorites. My son loves these. These are the Light and sh light, Shine a Light book. I always say Light and Shine. <laughs> shine a Light book. And this one is Secrets of the Seashore. I was kind of excited that we actually got one we don't already have. Because I've been ordering these books for a while. And I just finally decided just try. Do it. And here I am. So um, this one just is... You put the light behind the pages, and something would appear. It's probably, I can't do it right now because of the sun, but there's something would appear inside of the ocean. It's a really cute book. It kind of gets the kids into, um, I felt like these books um, really enticed my son in um, books, to be honest. And it's, I think, I believe it's the books that are just so fun and full of activity and full of, um, just not your regular, just page books that really gets them into books and gets them wanting to learn more, even the ones that are just pages and that doesn't have anything to do with um, shining a light behind it or flipping the flap. So it's a really cute book. Another one you'll get is the famous That's Not My Llama. So you're going to get that this That's Not My Llama book. And of course, you can see it's all, it's a touchy feely book. And um, I know these are one of the kids' favorites just because you get to touch little things and it's like, a, it's really cute. So, it's cute. So, you're going to get that. That's not my llama book. Another touchy feely book you're going to get is a baby one. This is called The Baby's First. Very first touchy feely animal book. So you're gonna see the sheep, you're gonna have a fluffy duck, a shiny fish, a hairy dog, and a soft rabbit. So it's really cute. And it's also great for um, kids that are learning to talk. Just saying even the two words, the hairy dog and the soft rabbit you know, to really help them as well and so it's really cute you're also going to get you are a star 
this book I read it. It's super cute. It talks about just we live in a big world and sometimes it's hard to find our place but soon when you discover who you are you're gonna fit right in and that no matter what you do you are a star so you're going to get you are a star book you're also gonna get the never get bored book this is actually really cute um, inside it has a ton of activities that you can do, let's say, if it's bored, what, you, what can we do? It comes with a lot of ideas. Um, this is the index, I believe, and it tells you things that you can do. Um, test your senses, stage a shadow puppet show, and the, the, the shadow puppet show, it actually shows you how to make your hand, how to form your hands to make certain puppets. There we go. So one of them shows you how to make a bird, make a rabbit, a dog. I couldn't even believe that you can have a deer. It actually looks quite like a deer. It's so cute. But this is a really great book. So I'm super excited that I got this book in my kids. Especially living in a place where it snows quite a bit. It gets cold and sometimes it's tough to get out toddlers um, outside. And so it's going to be a great thing to do with kids. Another book you're beginning is the Magic Painting Book. Excuse me. Um, the Magic Painting Book. This is really cute. Um, all you need is water. Dip your paintbrush, start painting, and sure enough, your pages will start looking like this. The front of the page, how the colors just start off. It's really cute and it's great when you're out of paint and you just don't want to deal with the painting, making a mess with the paint. My kids make messes with the paint all the time. So it's going to be a great book. Another book you will be getting is one of my favorites. I read it and I just, I absolutely love it. If you haven't read it and you need to get this book, I'm just saying, you, it's a cute book. It's a cute book to have and a cute book to read and a cute book to look back and and read in a sense of knowing that, you know, to don't be afraid of the what ifs. And this book is Jonathan James and the What If Monster. So it kind of starts off about this monster who tends to fill this little boy's um, thoughts and mind of, fears of what ifs so it kind of tells him or it sits in the tree what if you fall what if you skin your knee you know so it brings fear upon the child and the little monster goes on and saying what if there's a monster under your bed and um what if your paint no one likes your painting so it's kind of like a fear like don't do anything because people are going to make fun of you you're going to get hurt and it's just not going to be good. And towards the end, Jonathan James finally says, wait a minute. You know, what if that doesn't happen? What if something good happens? What, I'm just so tired of all your worries. And he starts like saying, what if I climb the tree and don't skin my knee? What if I do the painting and it wins first place? You know, so it's a great book to kind of share the kids even as adults, I know this touched me in sense because I deal a lot of just what ifs, to be honest. And and it's not that fun, but this book would actually kind of help the child know that it's okay to do things. Sometimes it's scary, but sometimes you just might have the time of your life, you know? So this is a book that you will be getting in your kit. You will also be getting a lot of catalogs. Um, I'm, I love, honestly, I love catalogs. I love things that I can just hold in my hand and see. Um, I love the, the the way that we could just look online too and search, but there's just something about holding and seeing and circling. I don't know, I'm just, I think it's just, I'm just that type of person. Everyone's different, but you will get catalogs for people, uh, for them to see. I know the catalogs 
in mind are going to uh, end this December, this month, because they're going to start the new one as well. So this, you'll be getting um, catalogs as well as order forms and some more business stuff. But I just want to share with you the books that will be inside of your kit and I hope you enjoy them and get a little more insight of what you'll find in your kit. And just thank you for watching and that is it. <laughs> thank you again. I hope that you enjoy your journey with used foreign books. And this I'm just joining and I'm I'm so excited and I know it is something that it's gonna be a wonderful thing for me and my family. So thank you for watching and may you have a wonderful day. Bye.